Hello, welcome back to Womiba Finance Channel. My name is Soyunye, and this is Womiba Finance Channel in YouTube. And welcome wherever you are. Take your own greeting. Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. Okay, today I will tell you about the most visited European country in the whole world. This country has so many things to offer. Yes, but now one of the ministers in the parliament of this country has many 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 problems he was lambasting the immigration people and all that saying that women and men that are farmers in the country they lost many things during the last harvestation because people were not allowed to come and work as farmers you know as a, 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 a farm job uh, uh, um, seasonal farm job workers okay that immigration office in the country delayed many people many people that you know many farmers that invested millions of euros in their farm were crying you know to him so the argument is this that the immigration minister rose up to say that they opened the channel and nobody applied, which is a lie. We know it's a lie. We know it's a lie. Hey, hey. Okay, now, I'll be telling you about this seasonal farm all year round because this country, they are big in tomatoes. They are big in uh, um, citrus. They are big. Yeah, citrus. When I mean citrus, I mean lemon. This country, they are very, very... If you go to Tesco and all the shop, their produce are on the shelves. Then they are good in... Um, in a wine, a, 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 um, um, you know, the, the, this fruit, plums, what are they calling it? Hey, God, <laughs> you know that uh, fruit they used to prepare wine, what are they calling it? Berries, is it berries? I don't know, you know that fruit, yeah, you can see it in the screen. You know that fruit they used to, I don't know what is, ah. <sighs> where's my brain? My dear, please, I'm getting old. So, you know, this country, the immigration minister now said that they have opened almost 5,000 5, <laughs> seasonal jobs with visa sponsorship. So now you can apply. Mm -hmm. So now you can apply. But before then, I'll be right back to tell you the four companies that are massively recruiting from the EU portals and from this country portals and I will be right back to tell you everything you need to know about it. Thank you. See you. Hello. Welcome back. Welcome back. Okay. Today, I will tell you something. You see, this beautiful European country is a country that we are battling immigration. They locked everything. And now farmers cannot, farmers cannot see workers, you know, to work with. But do you know why I'm choosing this country today? I will tell you why. And, you know, when I say, when I say that you should go to a country, I'm not saying you should go there and stay there forever. I'm not saying you should go there and stay there forever. That's not what I'm saying. I'm saying it's an easy route to citizenship or will take you to a country that will help you. Just hold on. I think my mic is having issues. So this country will take you to um will take you to um a place where if if you go to this country and become a seasonal worker, there are things you need to consider. Yes, and you people are not considering that, you know, often. This country, their citizenship will give you access to 190 con countries, 192, yes, 192 countries in the whole world. Okay, now, you are going there as a seasonal worker. So, you can from that seasonal worker apply to do a seasonal worker to the country of your best choice it's harder in africa than it is harder than from inside the country so what i mean is this when you go to this country legal you stay in a legal window you get the citizenship you move to where you want to move 
that is what I'm projecting. When we say go to a place like Lithuania, Latvia, Bulgaria, Iceland, you might not want to stay there because of the weather or because of the language barrier or because of anything. But they will give you, their citizenship will give you access, easy access to over 190 countries. Then when you get the visa, you cannot choose where you want to stay. I know that most people, they want the easy way out. But sometimes, or most of us, don't find the life, things of life easy. And that is why I'm here. So, I will just take you to how you can get a seasonal job in Italy. Number one, the requirements are this. Your passports, you've known what I said about passports. If you have a passport that is expiring very close, don't bother. Don't, I won't, okay, other people. But if you're from Nigeria, you can go and get the 10 years visa, 10 years passport. So go and get the 10 years passport because our international immigration offices, oh my God, will make you lose your mind. I'm not going to tell you everything, but go online and type uh, uh, issues with our, like, Europe, our offices, our immigration offices in Europe, or people that issue the passport. Just go, go and, and find the stories. You can see. So, now, you have gotten your passport, your, your insurance, uh, uh, um, travel insurance, paperwork, if you know any immigration officer, ask them. They will show you where to get it. Then, number third is that some of these farms, they provide accommodation. Majority of them, 90% of them. So, it's free accommodation. But whereby there's not any accommodation for you, you can now scout. There are many websites, even in right move everywhere, prime location. They are getting accommodation from everywhere around Europe. So, what you have to do is to go online and get a place close to that place you they have given you this, uh, 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 um, they have given you a uh, um, job because obviously you will know the city and you will know the town. So, you have to make the inquir inquiries and show them, though, in your contract letter, maybe the person said that he's not providing but will pay you this so, so amount of money in a month so you have to take care of your accommodation yes the next one is getting a contract and offer letter job offer letter seasonal job offer letter then after you have done that then the next one the next one is to show because when you pay for that uh, a place or hotel that you stay for one week to be able to settle down you have to put the 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 um, information inside all the uh, uh, particulars you're using to for your interview your visa interview and this country they give visa all the time yes so let's go to jobs how to get these jobs in italy yes the country is italy food are cheap life is slow you will enjoy italy even if you want to be taking your money mass with poop you are there okay number one is job in the country called delighty you know you will see all their websites and sometimes i drop phone numbers of this uh, company so that you can talk to them direct and do your own research and know how much they are paying like i always say negotiate your payments they will not bring you from Africa and pay you peanuts. It has happened to many people. Yes, I know many nurses that were like that. There are some companies that are paying people that they brought 10 pounds £10 per hour or 11 pounds or 12 pounds of minimum wage per hour. Yes, nurses. So, number two of the agency that are recruiting massively is farmjobs.it. The website is here and everything you need to know about them will be in their website you have to change it to english to read it to understand it they don't need you to have it uh, uh, prof be proficient in it in a italian language yes because most of this country in europe they don't speak english because they invested in english education 
So number three is agri job uh, comfort agri cultura. Please, <laughs> I don't know. You'll be seeing it on the screen. I don't know how to pronounce it. Then C I A agri colitore to italiani. So that's the fourth one. So plus many many others, and these are the major ones that you can get an answers that have uh, they have staff you know that work on the application that you can get answer, um, answers in a short while so now you have it go and apply don't say that you are not told don't say don't complain later go now and apply yes before you leave you know our tradition and this is where i will end this video but please subscribe share with your family and friends and tell everybody that you know to share this in their social media platforms and all that and i'll be bringing i pledge to bring good news uh with what is happening good news that's good news in italy immigration office opened five thousand five thousand jobs for africans so go and grab a job and start moving when you settle down in Italy and get everything sorted, then you can now come to UK so that we can party together. We can see you. Okay, I'm just joking. Okay, thank you so much for staying to this minute. And I will see you in the next video. Thank you so much. Bye-bye.